So you might be wondering how you can see your saved passwords on your Samsung or Android phone for the matter. Now, there's a few ways to do this, but if you have an Android phone of any sort, there should be a built-in password manager. Now, if you're using a, another you know, third-party application for your password management, then you'll have to go through the settings there. But if not, what you want to go ahead and do is you want to make your way over to your settings application. So you make your way over to settings. Now, every single Android phone is going to be different. So what I'd recommend doing is going through, clicking on the search bar at the very top, and just typing in password. So go and type in password as you normally would, and there should be a little setting that shows you like passwords and autofill or something like that, basically what you can do. So what you're going to want to do is click on passwords and autofill, and you should be able to find a little passwords and autofill button that shows up right here. Go ahead and click on that, and you should see a few different things. So for one, you might see certain passwords and you'll see your passwords that show up right here under you know Google, whatever, but also autofill service. So what you can do here is click on autofill, and it'll go and show you everything that's automatically autofilled here, which is pretty cool. But if you want to actually look at the passwords of your device, go and click here, and you should see your password manager. So what you can do here, and it starts saying start saving passwords. When you save a password to Google Password Manager, you'll find it here. So this is where you can find all the saved passwords within your Google account within this specific panel. Now you can also go through and click on that little settings icon right up here too. And you can go ahead and kind of, you know, figure out exactly how you want to go ahead and, you know, kind of set this up. If you want to, as you can see, there were a few things that allowed me to go ahead and add it, but I didn't, mostly because I didn't need a, you know, my password saved here. But on other devices, you can go and try doing it, and that's pretty much how you do it. So at this point, you should be able to see your passwords and everything, and that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.